Oh well, mate, the team fit a really good run of form at the moment, so there's got to be a lot of confidence coming to this uh, weekend's FA Trophy tie with Dagenham and Redbridge. Yeah, for sure. It's, uh, it's another massive game for us, even though it's a cup game, it's still really big for us. And hopefully we can just continue the run we've been on and being really solid at the back and yeah, hopefully we can get the win and continue through the cup. How did this uh, low move to Sutton come about? It came through my coach, uh, Bezo at Wimbledon. He's really good friends with the gaffer here at Matty, so they had a good, really, really good relationship and through that they got me here and played one game and they liked me so they took him on and took him off. Yeah. And he's certainly been thriving as a number one here at Sutton United, taking the spot off Jamie Butler. Yeah, for sure. I've been, it's just been an amazing experience for me in getting that men's football and proper competitive football. I can really feel the pressure in the games and it really means something to play for Sutton as well. And just to, get that experience and keep pushing for the team. How does uh, this environment differ to being in the uh, AFC Wimbledon environment? Uh, apart from being in four days a week, there's not too much. It's a bit more professional there, obviously, because being in League One. But yeah, no, I think the training is quite similar. And, it's, yeah, it's and obviously the defence has really stiffened up now. And how, what's your relationship like with the Sutton United uh, back line? Yeah, we're really, really strong, always encouraging each other, even if we make mistakes. I think we, we all know what the other people are going to do so that way we can judge the game of play and what, what's going to happen in the game. So I think we're really strong and I think we're only going to improve. Uh, can you talk to the viewers about your experience with their New Zealand national team? Yeah, the New Zealand national team. So my last tour was in India and there I made my first full cap. Um, that was an amazing experience where we won 1-0. Um, yeah, I had them um, when I was 19, I was in the 20s World Cup in New Zealand and we were the first team to get through to the round of 16 through the group, so that was a great experience again and yeah, I'm just waiting for the next one. And how have you found playing on the 3G pitch and playing in front of the fans here at Gander Green Lane? Yeah, the fans are amazing, especially the, the travelling fans have always been amazing to us and been really supportive so they always help us get through the game. And, yeah, playing on the 3G is good because you know, you know where the ball's going to go, and it's, it's a nice surface. And lastly, you mentioned it's a cup game this weekend. Uh, what have your experiences been like uh, with the cup in the past? Uh, I haven't had too much experience in the cup before, not especially like in the FA Trophy, but from all the cup games we've had before in my past team, who haven't done that well. So I hope we can change that here. Nick, thank you very much for talking to SUSC TV, and a good luck Saturday's game. Cheers, thanks, guys.